Hello, it is Mac here, and today I'm going to be talking about health statistics and does your rank actually determine your health in GTA Online. So this is an episode in my series called GTA 5 Gun Guide, where we will be going for every single weapon in GTA 5 and GTA Online and breaking out stats these weapons, talking about these weapons, and just giving a general review of these weapons. So while this is a part of my series called GTA 5 Gun Guide, it doesn't really have much to do with the actual weapons themselves. This actually will uh, kind of talk about if your rank will actually determine how many shots it will take to kill you. So the reason why we're talking about this is in GTA Online, if you rank up certain points or certain points in your rank up, it will say max health increase to, you know, something out of 100. You know, usually uh, it will be 100 out of 100 if you're a high rank. And, you know, this is something that, you know, people have always been talking about. Does rank actually determine how much health you'll have. You know, in my uh, series GTA 5 Gun Guide, where we will test out the weapons, I've always said the shots to kill on this weapon may increase or decrease depending on the rank of your enemy, which does apply to here. So I test out this, and I test out this kind of theory, and I test out on a level 294, and then I tested out the same the same person, and he had a level one character. So I test out with three different weapons. First one was the pistol, second was the carbine rifle, and third was the sniper, or the heavy sniper. And these had no attachments at all, and they had, you know, no attachments, and I tested out and saw how many shots to kill it, it took. So on level 294, it took 14 shots to kill with the pistol. It took 11 shots to kill with the carbine rifle, and 2 shots to kill with the sniper. Now, on the same, on, with the same weapons, on a level 1, it took 8 shots to kill with the pistol, 7 to kill with the carbine rifle, and only 1 to kill with the sniper. So what does this tell us? This basically tells us that the level 1 took less shots to kill. And it's actually a pretty big difference. If you look at the pistol compared to the, uh, you know, a pistol on the level 294 compared to level 1, it was actually a pretty big increase of 6 shots. That's pretty pretty big especially on a pistol which doesn't have the greatest rounds per minute same with the carbine rifle uh, you know if, if it takes you know an extra four shots to kill you know that's gonna determine how quick you're gonna kill your enemy so especially on a sniper which you know takes two shots to kill level 294 and only one to kill a, a level one so we don't know exactly uh how much health a level one compared to a level uh, level 294 has and we can't really tell i mean it's pretty hard you know uh, i mean uh, i you know it could be you know a certain health model or it could mean that if you're a low rank your shots to kill will be decreased now maybe in jobs and i haven't tested out in jobs but maybe if you're in like a certain job like deathmatch or capture or something then the the stats or the health stats are equal but i don't know if that's the case and it's just something that, it's kind of weird, I don't know why it's in the game, because it's kind of, I guess, the higher ranks have an advantage over the lower ranks. It's not very fair in that way. But anyways, uh, just I just wanted to make this video just to show you guys that, yes, your rank does determine how, uh, how many shots it will take to kill you. Now, I haven't tested out with every weapon, but it should be pretty similar, uh, depending on, you know, your, your weapon. Pretty much, if you're going up against a lower rank, it's going to be easier to kill them than if they if they were a high rank. Also, another thing is I don't know when it maxes out your health. I mean, it may be like a you know, gradual increase depending on your rank, or it may stop at a certain point. I was thinking I've heard that it may stop at level 100, then you have max health, but we don't know. Yeah, I mean, it may be like if you're level 1000, you may have lots more health than even a level 100. We don't know. Or it could stop at level 100 or level 50 or uh, 200, but for some reason, whenever you rank up, sometimes it will still say that you uh, your health increased, but it doesn't seem to increase. So it's just something weird to think about. And uh, just let me know your thoughts on this. You know, uh, do you think that this is fair or not? And do you think uh, you know when do you think that this stops, or do you think that it ever stops at all? Uh, depend on you know what, what rank you are. So let me know in the comments. Hope you enjoy. Feedback is always appreciated. I'll see you guys in the next video.